Hey folks, I'm the Mysterious JG, and welcome back to Let's Play Neo 2. So it looks like Magoichi is going to continue to be kind of a babyface in this uh, game, as he was in the original Neo. Well, you fought against him, but he was kind of presented as being a decent character, or just a decent guy. In this game, in fact, oh well, looks like, uh, what's his name here caught up with us? He's got something for us. I got something for you. The wise general's pillbox. No, I'm not worried about you. Yeah, we've beaten the Saika, it looks like. Oh, I didn't see it. Well. Yeah, uh. Hideyoshi, or I guess he's Yoshi in this game because we're Hide. But, um. Hideyoshi and, um. Katsuie were uh, not going to be buddies at any point, but um, I'm curious what this god medicine thing is. Poison of water. Not bad against um, certain enemies, I'm sure, but I'm pretty much really stuck on the whole chance of automatic recovery. So we got the Founder's Hall gate key. So now we can help Odo find his people. Uh, and hopefully we can find uh, the last of the missing Kadamas before we continue on. Because they're making kind of a big deal about these big bellowing beasties. That's going to be some kind of... Oh no, you were uh, something evil. I was convinced it would be the other one. Well, either way, I gotta figure out which ones are the are the evil ones and 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 know about it in advance for next time. So the ones that are just all dark, despite the fact that they they appear to be lit. I guess those are the the bad ones. Shinobi face play. Shinobi's back. You don't seem like much of a threat at this stage of the game, but uh, usually when I see one of them, either it's dropping on me from someplace I didn't previously see, or it's in a big group of enemies, or it's a trap, and you're trying to sneak up on one, but in fact get jumped by something else. That was weird. They, I hit something that messed with the camera. Just for a second. And now I'm having that little paranoia attack I sometimes get that I'm not recording. And I am recording, so okay. It's all good, baby. Not sure where I'm going to... Where am I going to actually advance right now? Oh. I can climb up on this. Yeah, you were shot. Oh, I hope you're okay. You seem to be okay. Oh, it's more of an embarrassment for him, I guess. Well, Magoichi shot you. We know that. He was trying to kill me, that jerk. Okay, well that's a bit of a relief. So we got the last Kadama. I, now it's just a matter of, I mean, be somewhat observant in case I miss like a cool treasure like, uh, you know, locks or a bagel. But otherwise, I'm just. Oh, I probably drop down from here right into the middle of an unescapable boss fight, don't I? Yep. Well, no, hold on. There's stuff on this side. Uh, there's like enemies over on this side.
So I got like nothing but I guess a few experience points for killing him. Dong ball, antidote, but it really wasn't worth it. It's just going to make me be missing one elixir as I fight the boss, ultimately. Are we even going to get a cinematic, or is this going to go straight to a fight with some non-speaking monster? Might be a cinematic with a non-speaking monster. Oh, there's a big angry feller. I didn't mean to do that. I hit the wrong button. Crap. Really hoping to make sure it stayed poisoned. Doesn't really seem to care too much about poison, does he? Yeah, poison didn't do a whole lot there. Might be I really need to take advantage when he misses those charges. Because he wipes out my keep. Oh, wow, there's a little graphical glitch there for you. Yeah, he wipes out my keep pretty fast. This has a real Ninja Gaiden boss feel to it. where you just need to... you really can only attack at certain times. I don't think I'm winning this on the first try. Bit of a gimmick boss. That was a lot of damage. Yeah, well, I won't be trading hits with them. Not if I want to win. I was going for my super funky counter, whatever it's called. Might be one where I just gotta try to stay behind him, or... Maybe I will win this on the first try, it's not impossible. Okay, that was bad. Okay, I gotta get my get out of jail free card. No, I can't. It's out. Ah. 
laser blast. A Star Wars sign to remind one of the existence of the film Star Wars. Laser blast. Okay, well, I don't think there's anything terribly wrong with my current setup. The poison didn't do that much to him. I mean, I feel like I should take at least one more crack at him before I go into the trouble of revising my setup. You, I can ignore. And that's that would be why there's not a whole lot of threat here. Because, uh... Yeah. I, this seems pretty doable. I got a reasonably good amount of progress done on the first attempt. I didn't get blown out of the water right from jump. the tail. I knew there would be some way he could hit me if I was behind him, but I'd been just kind of by luck, I guess, more than design avoiding it up until that point. I thought I had avoided that, but I guess not. get it set on fire, unfortunately. I uh, thought I had to dodge that, but I, I okay, game, I guess if you say I didn't, I didn't. Oh, I actually didn't do as well that time as I did the first time. I lost my... Um, Survive with no hit points left jutsu and didn't realize. And again, it's a lot of work to reset all of your jutsu, so I'm not going to worry about it too much. Uh, he didn't seem to care about getting poisoned, but just to, just to check, I'm going to try to poison him again. as much damage as we can out of the fire effect while well, it's easy to set up. But he didn't get poisoned even from getting hit with all of them in a row. So he's either immune to poison or just incredibly resistant to it. It would have definitely appear not to be the answer. And considering he has poison breath, it would make some sense. Again, I didn't evade, uh, whatever.
Oh, that's it. Again, the evade doesn't seem to be very reliable against that move. Oh, I'm disappointed. It feels like the first uh, first attempt I made, I did really well, and everyone since then I've actually done poorer. Although, in the first attempt, I shot all of my powers and ranged attacks immediately, so... Alright, well, Poison Shuriken are definitely not going to be useful here, so let's get rid of them entirely and see what I could be using instead. Regular Shuriken, that simple as it sounds, that might be the answer. There you go, I've got... Now I've just got more of the stuff that does work. And just a couple of little... regular shrukens to try out. For the tiny bit of damage they do, but... Okay. So, as ever, let's start strong. See what happens. Hopefully we don't have an entire failure video of this, but it's possible. Let's see if I can set it on fire twice. that quite set him on fire. Yeah. Unfortunately, I need to blow my load of fire shurikens to set him on fire. And that move, I'm not reliably avoiding it, and I'm going to need to if I'm going to win this thing. Which I kind of do. It seems like you're probably not going to win the game if you don't win this. Timing that one wrong, too. <sighs> wrong jitsu and... Not even making a dent on him this time. Oh boy, I've I've gotten worse every time instead of better. I was killed by a collision with Yuki. Collision in Korea. <laughs> the biggest pay-per-view ever not found on the WWE Network for uh, understandable reasons. Okay, so <sighs> don't know. I'm not really having a lot of luck with this one. Um, Could switch back to um, Kusari Gama. Not sure what's going to get it done. I need to. I need to figure out how to dodge that one attack where he throws you up in the air and eats you.
and timing that properly is important too. Okay, let's get him slowed down again. Um, okay, for a minute I thought that was going to miss him. A lot of damage there. He wiped out my don't take damage thing pretty quickly. That was a weird. I, I, come on, I know I dodged it. I believe I dodged it. Now, that time he didn't even let me uh, deplete his stamina before he uh, did the I get all my stamina back attack. Got to get better at charging his, attacking his different limbs. And I missed a chance to stun him there, but I didn't take damage from it, so I'm going to call that a, a win. I can finish him here. Sure hope so, because if I don't, I wasted uh, a big shot here. I gotta do a cinematic ending here. Of course I do. Don't mess it up now. Oh, it even turned Demonoid again for the end. Mission complete. Okay. Come with me if you want to live. Swordsman Kusarigama. Swordsman Kusarigama. A lot of swordsman gear. Thought there was no one I could. Yeah, well, I'm afraid you thought wrong, punk. I'm the rock and roll king of Kyoto, baby. So, all you commies, step aside. Oh, here's an interesting thing I didn't notice that probably was supposed to be used in this fight to, like, get attacks from above or something. Alright, well, it could be that this was part of the. The pro strat, and I just missed it, but that's okay. There's a few spots like that on the map where I could have been more intelligent about it, I suppose. So I saw that, what's her name? Uh, Mumio. Mummerset lady. 
at your service, lady. Who didn't help me until after I, you know, didn't show up until I'd already done the work. Listen up. We snack on danger done on death. Oh, man. I liked him. Even though it was pretty obvious he was going to die. I'm not sure why she was so close, but... Yeah, I don't want to think about people suddenly dying of illness. Um, you may not. You may know why. I don't want to think about people's illnesses suddenly taking a turn. Thank you for reminding me of that game. Well, who's he talking to? Oh, this is not... This is evil guy who... Or this is jerk who works for Mitsuhide. He's hypnotizing people. So the guy who worked for Mitsuhide is like Mr. Evil? Okay, well... I thought he was going to turn out to be all wholesome and good. And just, like, obnoxious, but apparently he's Mr. Evil. That really was quite something. Most impressive. So it seems the Oda forces were victorious once more, and there were spoils of war. A trove of spirit stones was found in the depths of the temple. And of course, I almost forgot. Tokichiro asked me to pass on a message. He said he's going to stay behind to guard the spirit stones, and that you should head to west to join the Hideyoshi army. Hmm, it's curious. Does he really have nothing to say about Hanbei's death? Yeah, that's true. I thought they were tight. The soul cores were purified and can now be attuned. I guess what we're going to find out is that he's getting uh, hypnotized by evil guy, and that we need to, um, you know, help him overcome his evilness. Or maybe we kill him and replace him. The Defiled Sanctuary has been unlocked. Ah, uh, but that's what I was looking for. Dojo missions. We haven't actually cleared this one yet. That being said, I'm a lot more interested in the Dojo missions that just unlocked. So we'll be looking into those... Next time, I'm the Mysterious JG. I want to thank you guys very much for watching, and I hope you'll join me next time as um, we do some dojo missions, and I can finally spend some skill points that I've been sitting on for quite a while. See you next time.